So I'm Darren Carter, I'm the organiser of Bristol Pride. Uh, we're here today in Castle Park for our fifth Bristol Pride event in, in Bristol. And uh, yeah, it's just a really exciting day, a free community event, and we've just invited everyone to come and join us and find out more about the gay community, what we do, the services and uh, things that happen within the city that maybe some people aren't aware of. But of course, we've also got loads of live entertainment, and this year we've got our biggest lineup yet. So there's 46 acts across three stages here on Castle Park. Uh, we've got Corona headlining the afternoon later on today, and the show closes with uh, boy band A1. Uh, which can be really exciting. I guess the main thing that people can expect is, you know, a really attitude-free day. It's just a great vibe here, really, really exciting. Um, but everyone's here just to have a really good time. We've got loads of stuff going on uh, for families. So we've got a great kids area where there's pipe making. Um, we've got Bristol Zoo here as well doing activities for young people. We've also got a cabaret stage for people who like a bit of uh, drag entertainment. But we've also got drag queens, pole dancers and burlesque. So, you know, really alternative scene as well as lots of food concessions from local caterers here in Bristol. You know, we've everything sourced locally here. So some really great produce. Oh, it's wonderful, and I love the parade. I've come from Queen Square. Tremendous spirit, and uh, what I love about Pride is the way the families join in. I see old people here, young people here, and uh, it's a brilliant Bristol event. The parade is a very historical element to a Pride event. Uh, in the very early days of Pride events, it was just a parade, that's all there was. And I think it's our opportunity to make a stand and a really visible presence in the city and say, look, actually, here we are. We are your gay community. We are your gay community's friends, family or supporters. And we're here to say that intolerance has no place in our city and that we're making a stand for all equality and diversity um, and that we just want to make a real visible presence. And it's been great. It's our largest parade yet. I think we had over 4,000 people marching up Baldwin Street. Um, so it's been really colourful, really exciting, but importantly there's a message behind it and even maybe here in the UK, you know, we, we've got equal rights and we're very lucky, but in other countries it's not so great, so it's our chance to make a stand for them as well.